Hello world folks, good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of world news and analysis. Before I move on to any further details, I'd really love to thank you all for enormous love and support. And in case you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for guys? Hit that subscribe button now, and don't forget to press that bell icon. Princess Kate has been accused of copying Meghan Markle during her last appearance. Kate wore a blue one-shoulder gown in a video appearance at the grand final of Eurovision Song Contest. Royal fans were quick to compare the dress to the one that Meghan wore at the NAACP Image Awards in 2022, according to Newsweek. One Royal fan wrote, So when will Kate stop copying Meghan? She copied Diana throughout 10 years of her marriage and now she starred with Meghan? This is an absolute madness. Another said, Kate copied Meghan's entire look. A third commented, Kate even copied Meghan's hairstyle. Kate's dress was designed by Jenny Packham, whilst Meghan's gown was designed by Christopher John Rogers. And it comes as Prince and Princess of Wales and Duke and Duchess of Sussex are no longer on speaking terms. King Charles is understood to be the only senior member of the royal family who's talking to Meghan and Harry. In the couple's Netflix documentary, the Duke and Duchess of Sussex executive director pinpointed the moment couples divided. James Holt is an executive director at Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's Archwell organization, and he previously worked as the head of communications for the Royal Foundation. Holt told Netflix that Kate and William's annual Christmas party splitting in two parties in 2018 was the moment he realized the separation was happening. He said every year, Kensington Palace hosts a Christmas party for the principals and staff, and so we're gearing for one big party. And very shortly before the party, it became two parties. He added, actually, that was the point you realize these offices are separating. So what do you guys think about this news? Do you think Megan deliberately trying to battle Catherine for grabbing more attention? What's she doing? Write it in the comment section below. Let me know what you think. Until then, I guess we'll just have to wait and see if things turn out to be something after all. Also, if you never want to miss any of my Sizzling Oil updates like this, subscribe and press that bell icon. It's as simple as that. So until next time, hasta la vista.